The building you see here was dubbed the Spanish Governor's Palace in 1915 by Adina de Zavala, one of Texas's first preservationists, when she began a 15-year campaign to save the structure from demolition. Contrary to its name, this structure was never home to the Spanish governor. Rather, it had been the home and office of the local Presidio captains, and is hardly what one would call a palace. Later, it would be leased to a variety of businesses, including a pawn shop, a wholesale produce store, a clothing store, school classrooms, saloons, and a tire shop. Eventually, San Antonio purchased the property in 1929 and finished restorations in 1930, turning it into the museum that it is today. San Antonio's Tricentennial Moments on KSAT 12 are powered by Frostbank and Sierra Cars Trucks and RVs and the Children's Hospital of San Antonio.